Stevenson gets the 85-45 win over Goucher here tonight at Owings Mills Gymnasium. Glenn Clark with Coach Jackie Boswell. Coach, I, uh, I see some of the things that you say on uh, social media sometimes about how you've been proud of your team's effort and that um, the results just sort of haven't quite been there, but it's not for lack of trying, and you've been pleased with them. How good does it feel to have a night like tonight where they come out and they get a pretty emphatic win? Um, it feels really good. I mean, that's what we talked about. We had to come out and really kind of hopefully prove something to ourselves and gives our, give ourselves a little bit more confidence now going into some more conference play. Um, you know, I, I thought that our defense was really good, but our defense has been really solid all the way, all along. But hopefully today we've taken a step forward in showing that our defense can really spark our offense. And, you know, when that happened, then we were able to score easily instead of having to really struggle for every point. One of my favorite things tonight, look, Brandy plays well all the time, but six steals tonight, and I was joking with you before, it felt like 60. I mean, it just yeah. felt like every time the ball was anywhere around her, she was poking it away. How much does that effort really stand out, you know, even for a player as good as Brandy Hall? Mm -hmm. I, I know it really stands out because she took us seriously that, you know, we got to come out and we not we got to play well, you know, um, and, and she took that to heart and I thought she played excellent today. And, and then I think everybody kind of followed suit with her. She's really been our composure, I think, for the last um, couple weeks, um, just playing solid and, and working hard and everybody's starting to follow that a little bit and maybe taking a like a, a little breath and, you know, we can just kind of ease into everything. And um, I couldn't be more proud of the way she's playing for us right now. We really need her. A lot of players got an opportunity to get on the floor, especially there in the second half. And you have some neat moments. You know, Bailey knocks down a three. You have a couple of baskets that really get the uh, the bench going. Yeah. How much does that mean for everybody to see some players get in there and do some things in the second half? Well, that means a lot to them, and I know it, it means a, a lot to me too because we can, you know, cheer for each other and push each other. You know, Carly came off and hit some threes as well, and you know, I, I'm just really proud of them to be able to support their teammates like that and be happy for them. Carly hit two in the first half too, right? Like she, she did. She, she was she looking out with twelve, right? No, no doubt. She looked pretty good tonight. All right, now as you mentioned, back in the conference play on Wednesday night, what has to hold over? What do you need to carry over from an effort like tonight as you get into Wednesday? The intensity and defense. I mean, really, because the intensity and defense caused the easy points in the you know 85 um, made it look easy because we worked really hard on the defensive end. Right, coach congratulations on a great win we will see you back here on Saturday. Great thank you. She's coach Jackie Boswell I'm Glenn Clark for GoMustangSports.com.